And that's bold. He's off stump. Callum Ferguson's run. Oh, he's hit his stumps on. That's a massive blow. And that's bold as well. Top of off. How about this? Tasmania on fire. A little bit of a way movement through the hands of Sandu, and it'll go through for a couple of runs here. This occasion, he goes off the back foot and punches one past Jewel again. This occasion, that one stuck in the wick a little bit, popped up. And foolish to Ross and also middle of the leg, but he whips it off his toes. Not for the first time today. This one edged through about third slip, and it's going to beat the fielder. At Slow ball, half volley driven, four runs. Time driven again, Sandu two full. And beats the fielder, this time it'll run to the boundary for four. The plate, Jake Lehman. And brings up his 50. Very patient 50. Short ball and out. Well, he gets his 50, the shorter ball, and hit it straight to Bo Webster at mid-wicket. Ross has a big swing, doesn't connect very well, but it ends up racing away to fine leg where George Bailey's coming off the rope. That's where he goes. He beats the infield and gets himself to 50, a well-earned 50. Real fighting 50 for him, Alex Ross. That one's wide, one-handed from Ross, but can't run out opportunity at the bowler's end. Oh, they've had a mix-up. He digs one in, he smacks into the stumps. Jay Minnie. Oh, he steps away and slashes that one over the top. Races to the boundary. Tries the ramp this time. Gets it up in the air. Keeper runs back. Takes the catch. So Zampa's gone. Just a bit too clever for himself. Same time. This time he goes over the top of the short fine leg and gets four runs. This one swing and a miss from Richardson. And he's been run out. Oh. Umpire's given it. So he didn't quite get back in time. So Kane Richardson run out on the last ball of the West End Redbacks inning. So they will finish at 9 for 228. Big contributions in the middle order as that one's playing out through the leg side. It should make the rope pretty comfortably as Tasmania get off to a flyer. Played off the toes well. Gets through square leg. Valente chasing hard. They've gone for two. There might be a third. They were wide, smashed through the infield. That one in off stump, and the third time this over, Caleb Jewell drives one. This one's worked fine for four. Lovely shot from McDermott. That one's shorter and cut behind square. Should go all the way, and it does. Four runs. See if he can find one. On this occasion he does. Takes off. Gets to the non-strikers. Gets himself 50. Played a quick one in the air. And four runs. Or has it gone all the way? I think it might have gone all the way. Up by signal six. And that's 50 for Ben McDermott. Reverse sweep up in the air. Catch. Taken. Adam Zampa. Gets the catch and... Travis here, the skipper. Comes down the wicket, Wade plays over mid on beautifully. One bounce, four. To Wade, who thought about coming. Got it high, it's gone real high. Banking himself underneath it. Catch taken. Flat one. Pulled away. And pulled away for four. Good shot from Jordan Silk. Quick one from, oh, there's a mix-up here. Who's going to be run out? It will be Jordan Silk. Slow ball works it onto the leg side to bring up an excellent 100 from Ben McDermott. That one swung away in the air and up and over the boundary. And he's bowled him. Well... It was brief, it was exciting, and it's over. Throws it wide, straight to Travis Head at cover. 
It's another wicket. Faulkner gets it down the ground. Richo comes steaming in again. The throw to Carey isn't going to cause any dramas. It's the run that we think has got the job done. Now they're shaking hands. So a win for Tasmania, their first of the Marsh Cup.